Jimmy Walker uh, did contact Norman's office in 2020, and um, he pitched a Good Times cartoon, which would include every all of us except for Esther Roll. And um, and um, we didn't hear anything back from them, but um, a few months later, or I think six months later, they came up and said they, they have a cartoon. Sony said they had a cartoon coming. And so we, uh, so my manager called up Norman's office to see if it's, if we, if we were included. I mean, if, if you're going to do that, you know, let us know. So uh, they said, oh no, it's going to be generations later and it's going to be like progressive or whatever. And, um, but, but Brent Miller loves us very much, loves me and Jimmy. I know that. And so he said, but um, I can give you a small role in there. You said that you were told it was going to be a cartoon and that it was going to be progressive. It, that's exactly the criticism is that it doesn't feel progressive at all. So when you see something that, that actually is not progressive, it kind of brings you back into the projects two generations later. Um, so Thelma had a baby. What happened to that baby? Um, I wanted to be a surgeon. I guess I was. Uh, JJ was a famous artist. So you have positive images generations before that. And then all of a sudden you see this. You know, I'm not knocking it because I don't know what the whole show is going to be. Maybe they'll bring it, lean it more back, you know, back to a more, more positive situation. But when you have the name Good Times on top of that, our audience for 40, for 50 years have been really in our corner. You know, they've always supported us. So they were disappointed that they didn't have it more progressive as, as the way I was told it would be. Have they said anything to you, Bernadette? H have the producers explained this to you? Have, have, have they said anything about the way it turned out? Absolutely not. Well, I want, I want to say something about my friend Norman Lear. Um, I was at his 100th birthday. And I did mention, you know, I said, Norman, well, how do you how do you think about, about the cartoon? How do you like the cartoon? And how's it going to be? You know, I'm trying to give some information. But, you know, <laughs> so he, he kind of smiled. He looked at me and, and it was as if he didn't really understand what I was, you know. You know, so maybe it was a senior moment. He is a hundred. He was he was a hundred, you know. So I don't know if it was that. I But I, I love Norman. And I do believe that he maybe was told the same thing I was told. I don't know. But, you know, I'm sure, you know, hey, because he only produced quality work. So I got to say in his behalf, I don't know if he really understood what it was going to be about or he just knew it was going to be a cartoon for, for good times. Because like everyone else, you think of good times, you think you have the title on there, you automatically think of it.